Hello and welcome to my home. My name is Jackie. So this is a jewelry review-ish. Um, I've had this for several years now. I have to put it through consignment and sell it back to another collector because financially I could keep this, but I can't wear it. What do I mean by that? I now have a disc and neck issue. When I bought this, I didn't know I had. So this is a one of the most stunning necklaces you will ever see. So let me show you more detail. This is what turquoise looks like when it's not stabilized. Almost all the turquoise you see today is stabilized turquoise. But traditionally, they used to hand chip unstabilized turquoise. So you see how it looks, the cleavage marks of how it's been, um, the stone looks a little like kind of round, not not perfectly rounded. This is hand chipped and then polished, right? So when you chip stone to shape it, it cuts on a, a natural cleavage line. So there's a lot of waste material when you do it this way, which is why they don't do it this way anymore. Now that they can stabilize turquoise, they um, almost everything you buy will be stabilized. So this is hand, absolutely hand shaped, the whole thing. This is San Domingo, I believe, the um, artist who made this. This is too heavy for me to wear. I love this necklace. I think this necklace is absolutely one of the most beautiful necklaces I've ever owned. This is the most single single most expensive piece of, piece of jewelry in my entire home. Um, I'm going to consign it for whatever they can sell it for. It doesn't matter. It's not something I can just put on the shelf and leave because this needs to go to somebody who can enjoy it, wear it, and love it. I can just put it on and take it off. I can wear it for short times, but I can't wear it to work. I can't um, enjoy it the way it should be enjoyed, and it shouldn't just be sitting in my collection. The color and quality of this turquoise is phenomenal. Um, you're not going to see stuff like this very often. This came from a pi private collection into um, the person who I bought it from, and I buy jewelry from them I have for over 20 years. They deal directly with artists, and they, I normally don't like to consign back art pieces that I've purchased, but this is just one of those cases where I can't wear it, and it's too valuable just to sit here, to sit in my collection until, like, my, till you know, end times of my life, right? This deserves to be used and worn and loved, and, and things like this that are hand-wrapped like this, uh, you have to... Um, periodically rewrap them. This is fraying a little bit on the end, but that is completely okay. Um, this is an absolutely gorgeous, stunning piece of jewelry, and I wanted to show it off before before it goes away out of my collection, and it is leaving my collection. Um, so whether it sells a year or two or five, it's leaving my collection. So anyway, have a great day. Thank you for watching my video. And uh, yeah, it's hard to part with things you love, but sometimes you have to. Have a great day. Bye.